Hi Aquarius, welcome to your March 23rd, 2019 weekend reading, but I'm going to call it the weekly reading because it's already more than halfway through Saturday. Sorry I'm so late. Okay, let's get started. First of all, you have the King of Wands in the upright and in the how, that's in the what? In the how, you have the sky in the upright. In the why, you have nine of coins in the upright. And in how you're gonna feel about it, you have the magician in reverse. And in the advice, you have six of coins upright. At the bottom of the deck, you have five of wands upright. So let's go back to the beginning. King of wands, this is someone who, this is the father of fire, um, like the father of action. This is a, a mature, uh, an established man. This card indicates a solution. This is a self-made man, um, creative, forceful. Um, they're bold, they're looking at this. This is the how, this is the sky, and this this is called counting, and I it's, it's very much like the star card in regular tarot. It means hope. I think it means counting your blessings. Um, this can mean mindful of envy, others may want Others may want what you have. It can also mean theft, and it can mean a bad surprise, um, something like a, some kind of crisis, um, and it can also mean tired. It can mean a sudden illness, and it also means inspiration. It's, it's kind of like a, I don't know, I kind of think of it as like the disaster card sometimes, um, something, something unexpected happening to you. So in the Y, you have the nine of coins in the upright, this means the forest, and this is called the result. So this is um, like consequences. It's realizing um, how much you've done and how much you have left to do, not feeling quite satisfied yet, you still have more to do. It can mean on a high, working on your craft. Um, it can also mean realizing what you have and taking pleasure in that. It's, uh, it's kind of like this, like counting your, um, counting your blessings. And this is also, to me, this is a Virgo card. This is a discipline, self-discipline, self-reliance card, working on your craft. Um, how you're gonna feel, this is the magician in reverse, and this means mental illness. So I'm getting the feeling that something happened, something bad happened. Maybe you are, um, you or someone else is, is really kind of on top of it, and you're feeling mentally tapped out and confused. Um, PTSD just popped in my head. You might need a timeout. You're just done. Or maybe this is how you feel on the outside, like you've got everything under control. But this is how you feel on the inside, like you're just cracking up, and you need to you need a break. You need your own. Someone needs to look after you. And then in the advice, you have the six of coins in upright, and this also means very confusing situation. This is a card about having and not having, um, about plenty, about sharing, um, physical well being. This. It almost, it's attached to this card. It, I'm, maybe I'm going on the wrong stream here, but I'm picturing something happened and somebody needing to divide up resources for people. And then five of wands means gold. This is in the bottom of the deck. This is called gold. It's, it means the furnace. It's, it's um, gain, gaining through hard work. This can also mean fun. This isn't a bad card. It's a debating card. It's a... A sparring card, it can mean rebellion, disagreement. It can mean, um, to me this is meaning someone, I'm, I'm taking this as you, is trying to maybe keep something under control and you're feeling like you need a break. Um, so maybe that's your advice, that you need to take a break too. It looks like you're looking after a bunch of other people and trying to keep something under control. That's how I'm seeing it today. Um, so that's your reading Aquarius and the song that came on when I hit shuffle for your shuffle was A Night in Dreams by White Demon. Sorry, White Denim. Thanks so much. Have a great weekend. Love ya.